Hi, it's Victoria Mavis coming to you from Two Minute Tidbit. What I wanted to talk to you today is about things of the past, memories of the past. It is in fact Mother's Day and that triggers a lot of memories for a lot of people. Whether they're good or bad, it triggers memories because we all have probably something that happened at some year that we remember and we celebrate and we honor our moms and you know, our moms day just like we honor our dads on Dad's Day. But one of the things that happened this morning when I was waiting for a friend to pick me up uh, to go out is I felt like I was a 10 year old again waiting for the bus. It was a fairly chilly morning and there was overcast and there was fog. And there was a, something about waiting. She told me she was going to be 15 minutes late picking me up. I was fine with that. But it, it was like all of a sudden, it was a great morning just to go outside um, and take a few pictures while I was waiting for him. But it, there was something in the air and something in the whole presence of the day that made it seem like when I was 10 years old again. Or maybe it was more like I was six and it was my first time I ever I went on the bus. So two minute tidbit, I want you to think of the past. Not in terms of always reliving the past, but looking at answering questions from the past as an access to the future. Uh, and I say that because many times people get triggered by events. You know, I, I talk about Mother's Day, I always thought Mother's Day should be something else than what it was and be celebrated differently. And when I was able to let go of that is when I was really able to enjoy the day that's in front of me. So wherever you are, wherever, whenever you hear this, think about being in the moment. And that's the greatest gift that we have of all. It's being in the moment with the one we're with, the one that's in front of us, even if that's just the apple tree across the way. Thank you, Two Minute Tidbit.